Hello, people. Welcome back to some more Luigi's Mansion. Three. <laughs> Almost forgot the three there. Uh, I'm Vito, and Robert Link is here playing. Hello to you, uh, insert viewer name here. <laughs> so, uh, we're on the second floor. That's the place that was blocked the last time. Well, not necessarily the last time, but the other time that we were on this floor. So I think the dog stole some cheese last time. Not sure why. He was probably hungry. Because obviously that's the thing. Oh, okay, well, it's French bread, obviously. Who's never in the mood for French bread? I don't know. <laughs> oh, I got a vacuum. <laughs> Clean up all the crumbs. I'm just realizing it's probably not a very interesting response to say, I don't know. <laughs> just say, uh, it's a mystery the universe will never solve. <laughs> the world will never know. Just having a good time. Maybe I don't have to murder them. No, 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 no. Peace was never an option. <laughs> So you have chosen death. <laughs> so you have chosen bread. <laughs> whack them. Whack them all. Yes. Whoa. You gave me energy. You did that a bit too early. <laughs> Stop it. Okay. <laughs> like, how dare you? Wait, there's money? Or... There was some money, I think, from the trash bin. Oh. Did it blend in with the, uh, whatever those are? I guess so. The apples, I think. Huh. How do I launch things again? I know there's a way. You just do the... To blow, but I don't think you can do it with this object. Oh. All right, something's burning. Oh, money. Someone's having a good time. So what the heck is this green? I love just covering my kitchen with smoke. It really enhances the mood. Says the atmosphere. It's like, since I'm probably a ghost, I don't have to worry about lung cancer. Like, here's your smoked beef, and smoked cheese, and smoked bread, and smoke. <laughs> uh huh. You can't do it alone, Luigi. You need more power. In situational in situations like these, you've got to work together. Do you remember how to summon Luigi? It is press the right stick. Oh. We should we should not wait so long to do these right. episodes. <laughs> right. I think if you're blowing, you're just spreading it around more. Oh. You can't do it alone, Luigi. You need more power. Yeah, In situations like these, you've got to work together. You won't get tired of me saying the same thing over and over, will you? Okay, for a moment I thought it was like a ghost fish in there. Look what you've made me do. That mustache, though. Okay. 
Wait, wait. Why is he in the Is he just sitting? <laughs> yes, I think so. Oh, gosh. Oh, I have a shield. Okay. Ow. Try and aim, you jerk. What? It said it would hit. Why is it lying to me? I don't know, maybe it's not lying. Oh, was it actually on there? I think so, but it won't let me suck it in. Hmm. I'm actually dying here. Oh. Yeah, that seems like a better strategy. <laughs> I knew that. <laughs> yeah. I was just making it hard for myself. Hit him give in, him a fair flight. Hit him into the grill. Burn him. <laughs> Cook him with his own stove. Oh. So I can't do it while he's spinning. Can't aim. That was funny. He pulled out a fish like he was going to throw it and then he just dropped it. Like, nope, changed my mind. And now it's clipping through the uh, closet oh. thing. I don't know what you want to call it. But, uh, I think it's a fridge. Yeah, I think so. Some collateral damage. <sighs> Alright, let's get the life. Okay. Right now, things to throw. Oh, that's probably what the fish are for. Oh, look at your health. Uh, WX78. Ow! Oh, you ruined it. <sighs> this could take a while. Did you Did you say someone's name? I'm just, I'm just, uh, I'm not sure. I, I have to look back at this in editing. Even. I'm sure I did. I'm so sorry for the robot, robot voice that has to be placed over. Actually, just, just say what? his, just say his username now. And WX78. We'll, yeah, I'll replace it with that. <laughs> so it won't be robotic. It'll just be you saying that. It's probably going to be a bit confusing for anyone who's not seen, oh. like, some of the older ones I've done where we actually did that already. But yeah, I was thinking about when you said, you know, WX78 would approve. Makes me think, do you actually know the meaning of that number? Or at least why? Just that it's a reference to <clears throat> something that uh, good Christian children would not talk about the stream. Wait, I'm not streaming anyway. What am I talking about? I was just wondering if you knew. Doesn't mean you have to say what it is. Just wondering. Yeah. Wait. No, flash it. Really? Stupid ham thing. Sorry, the whole WX78 thing probably is distracting. That conversation. Well, there's some more help. Do you know how hard it is to aim like in this game? Yeah, this is without the uh, the gyro sensitivity on. Okay. Die. I never even liked your cooking. Where was keeping those? <laughs> Probably best we don't. I was just thinking maybe in his hat. I mean, is that where you keep your extra ingredients? Yeah. Okay, talk with the fish. Oh, no, I can't. So I say, that's where I keep my uh, 
Like a pilot rats. <laughs> and then a rat appeared. As I was thinking about it. Like a pilot rats. Alright, where is he? There he is. Unless. I get the bigger slices. I think they're about the same size. Oh, there's a dollar. Oh. What I meant was, like, get the bigger ones, not just the crumbs on top. I don't think you need any more. Well. Also, I think my voice cracked. Yeah. Am I supposed to suck him up? I don't think I don't think you're supposed to be watching him. There you go. Yeah. Come on. This is getting a little old. Why are they even eating it? Do you think it's cheese or something? I was just thinking about it. It's like, maybe? But it wouldn't smell like cheese, would it? Unless Do this chef has been keeping it in a pocket with cheese. <laughs> maybe. Do, or, do rats even see color? I mean, then probably. Can't take it with me out to the side, so that means he's probably somewhere in here then. I don't actually remember. <laughs> Shoot. I'd say check check the garbage. Alright, he might be outside. I Oh wait, I think there was cheese out there. Or did the dog eat it? Or did I suck it up? I think I think Oh, there is a mouse hole there. Yeah, okay, oh. yeah. Okay. Oh, I remember now. Yeah. Oh. Oh. M -m 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 Mario. But yeah, I think when we entered this hallway the first time, the polter pup took the cheese and went through the door with it and we were commenting on, you know, apparently it was really easy for him, but not easy for the maid. Yeah, yeah, that's right. I already know I'll get through that, you twit. You fool. You cannot escape me. What? He's got friends? <laughs> what are you doing here? Oh, I'm guessing these are slightly tougher ones. Oh, wait, they're in these. Yep, there you go. Drawing a blank again, help. <laughs> I was thinking of earlier saying like, you know, have you uh, got that list yet of things you wanted to talk about when things are silent? I worry that would make it feel a little unnatural, but yeah, I don't know. 
Well, maybe just, just, you know, it's like not an entire script, just, you know, something <laughs> to start talking about. Yeah, I don't know. I haven't come up with any list for that. I'd have to actually think of things. How is it alive after that? The pig is still up there. Help. Oh, uh, now I have to go in a new direction. That was funny when you went over there and you flashed at him. You said Mario. I don't know if you pressed the button for that, but <laughs> I, it's like, I did. Mario? It's like, no, that's the rat you've been chasing. Right uh, wrong button. Yeah. There we go. Money. The heck is that yellow stuff? That thing over here. Is that supposed to be a lava lamp or a soap dispenser? I was thinking soap. It's kind of odd colored soap. Ooh. I was just thinking when you uh, got the gold out of the painting. I think uh, Shadow Wolf said he watched one of the episodes and he was complaining that you missed some of the gold from something. <laughs> oh yeah, you mentioned that I missed like one gold coin or something. <laughs> it's like, really? It might have been a bar. Mm, still. <laughs> like, I know I've fact I passed the bar up earlier. That's because... I didn't quite catch what you just said. The, I know there was a bar I passed up earlier, but, you <clears> know, <throat> so what? Ooh, bubbles. Yeah. I can't do it with the other sink. I don't know. There we go. Uh, yeah, there you go. Oh. Remember, remember, kids, always wash your hands with money. I think money isn't that clean usually. But <laughs> I know, that's the funny part. Alfred? I guess that's a money bird? Yeah, those exist. Just like money trees. How to comment on that one? Love how it appears like there's nothing in there, and then just actually wait, is there something up here? No. Oh, there's a dollar. Do you need some direction? Hmm. I I don't want to say yeah, but I think I might. Go back in there. You haven't done any. You haven't done everything in here. I was gonna say anything for some reason. I was like, wait, wait. That's not what I mean. Hmm. Wait, that is an air vent. I think, or something. And those usually have holes in them. Usually. I like how that makes Luigi's hat go up. Like, careful, Luigi. You are not waterproof. Oh, I can't I just go down the drain? Like, you know, plumber? It is probably not hygienic. Oh, wait. I just remembered. What if? There we go. Hey Wait, what the? 
I wonder if he was like in the middle of an animation so maybe you couldn't flash him. Maybe. There we go. There's no gem. Yay. Now then. Okay, so what did you just do? What did you just use? Oh. Uh, oh. A hand dryer. No. <laughs> there you go. Oh wait, this looks a little bit familiar. Yeah, I was like, come on, this is the part you're stuck on again now? Okay, for a second I thought there was like some stomach organ or something, but now it's just a huge pretzel shaped bread. For a second I thought it was like a turd. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently a pile of food is sufficient to block a door. I mean, yeah, obviously. Not like it would fall over or anything. We've been found out, boys. Scatter! Wow, he actually nipped you. Because it doesn't disappear. That was just kind of stuck. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, yeah, that's not uh, been in the nicest places. Just been through. It's just a few digestive systems, you know. Bathroom. And the worst of all, the chef. <laughs> Actually, that could be one of the worst. <laughs> because if he had it with all his rotten fish or whatever. Yeah. Bad. Well, not necessarily rotten, but smelly. Oh, they might be rotten. Uh, where are you going? Oh, is there not more over here? I mean, you can check. There might be some extra stuff you can get, but... uh, Like, can I not go in here? You might be able to. Oh, it's just more food. With money in it. And a emerald cupcake? Wait. Oh, I thought that was a gold bar. No, it's just one of those vials of, uh... Whoa! Mario? No, I don't think that's Mario. That is a huge fish. Might just be able to vacuum it. Oh, okay, flashbacks to squid. Yeah, okay, it's alive. Or not wet. Oh, it didn't work. I just didn't want to go in there myself. For some reason, I think in my game, it was kind of bugged. It would not let me enter, but I ended up getting him to, like, walk kind of into the teeth enough that his hitbox hit the golden side anyways. Huh. But I could not get him to phase through it. Huh. 
weird. Also, hello, ghost pup. I can't remember your name. I just call you that. I think it's Polter Pup. Yeah. All right. To the elevator. One running montage later. Or, oh no, wait, no, this isn't the way to go. I thought it led to the exit, but no. Yeah, so far I really haven't been cutting these. Because, I don't know. Even if there are, like, the awkward silences. I'm not sure if I should. Hmm. I guess maybe for future series. Yeah. Maybe, but I guess since I haven't been so far on this series, I probably won't. Eh, Alright, that makes sense. I'll keep it at least somewhat consistent. Oh, yeah. Luigi, you're doing a great job. Why don't you make your way back to the lab, okay? There's something I want to tell you. Tell me here, you twit. <laughs> See you soon. Ugh, fine. It's like completely not acknowledging the fact that you just made an excellent suggestion. It's like, no, we're doing it my way. I'm going to ignore the fact that I've been a complete idiot with my suggestion for you to come back to the lab when you don't need to. I'm the one with the PhD here. Back to the garage. Yes. To the EGAD not so mobile. Oh, Luigi, you're finally back, eh? You shouldn't keep an old man waiting, you know? I mean, it didn't take that us that long. That took like 10 seconds. <laughs> yeah. I've been busy down here. This lab is almost fully operational. Operational. Then the rebels will know the true might of the Empire. <clears throat> By the way, Luigi, you must be getting pretty good at it. <clears throat> pretty good at exploring the hotel, am I right? Have you been sucking up stuff with the poltergust goo? Your, your pockets must be fit to put... That's an odd way of saying whatever he's saying. Your, your pockets must be fit to bursting with all the money you've picked up out there. Fret not, I have the perfect solution to your cumbersome currency conundrum. Just give it all to me. Okay, you seem trustworthy. Drum roll, please. I'm proud to announce. Freaking keyboard. <laughs> Professor Egan's shopping network is now open for business right here in the lab. Ta-da! I've stocked some rather useful items. They're all yours for a modest fee. <laughs> to celebrate the shop's grand opening, just this once, I'm giving away a free gold bone. Huh. Go on, Luigi. Just select the gold bone to claim it. Da-da-da-da! Yeah. Cold bones are incredible items that give you a second wind if your health runs out. You'd be wise to keep a few on hand, so if you want more, you'll have to buy them. <laughs> I've got I bleh, I've got other items in stock, so feel feel free to browse. <laughs> you need speech therapy. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I almost forgot. I have one other matter to address while you're here. Luigi, could you turn around for a moment? I need to adjust your poltergust goo. I'm not going... Just ignore the knife I have in my hand. I'm not going to stab you. And done. I've added a new feature to the poltergust goo. Another one? My research indicates that boos are hiding, in, hiding out in this hotel. See, I didn't expect the out part. I just added a feature to help you track them down. Don't worry about the details. I'll fill you in later. Thank you. Well then, that's it from me, Luigi. Get back out there and keep exploring the hotel. Oh, all right. Let's see. Is there anything else other than those three? No, oh, doesn't look like back order. <laughs> we will not need the gem finder because I have written down everything. Ah. So I'll take another one of these. And a 
back we go. Let's check out the fourth floor. Wait, what is this here? Oh. It's like I was looking at the uh the recording for a sec. Hey, it looks like you've stumbled across a boo already. Mario? That's a sign no, no, not Mario. A boo. Anyway, that's a sign that indicates there's a boo nearby. Let me explain it in more detail. There are some note cards or <laughs> where are those note cards? You need note cards. You see, Guichi's body is made of a material I've dubbed goo. Wow. Goo reacts to the frequency emitted by boos. So if there's a boo hiding nearby, the goo will vibrate to indicate this. The closer you get to a boo's location, the stronger the vibration will be. You'll definitely be able to tell when you're really close. It just explodes. From, all, from vibrating so much. Don't get that close. Did all that make sense, Luigi? A strong vibration means a boo is nearby. Okay, get out there and catch a lot of boos. <clears throat> I'll start thinking. Yeah, I'll start thinking about the best way to organize them. Goodbye. All right, you want me to get boos? All right. You think you have an alcoholic problem, though? I, I, yeah, I caught on to what you were saying, like right before you said that. I was like, mm, no, that's the wrong kind of booze, Luigi. So I think the way this works is if you interact, if you're getting these vibrations and you interact interact with an object that the boo is not hiding in, I think the boo moves or something like that. I don't know if it will this time because it's like your first time or whatever and it's kind of scripted. Wow. So it's oh. it's not vibrating a lot, so it's nuts. Okay, now it's calling down a bit. So how do I know? I think it's usually an interactable, so it's probably, yeah. Oh, ho, ho, I'm Boothman. Looks like you found me. Or did you? Do they all do this? Please tell me they do. I think so. Yes. Boothman. Did you notice something moving? Ah! <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> I did not. Pay attention to the fog. Wow, you idiot. Wait, so how do I attack him? Alright, well... What do you do to things that are either not fully phased in or invisible? Oh. <laughs> I didn't. Oh, it only goes one damage. Yes, but it goes very fast. <laughs> Another example of pretty good game design is that um, I don't think most rooms with booze will have fog, but there's the first one. Okay, so that makes this a little easier. Yeah, because you can tell where he is sometimes. It's like, hmm, I must, I must have to do something to him. I guess in the future I'll just have to like spin around, like, like radar. All right. All right, so that that could probably be it for this episode. Yep, we learned how we got a new uh, elevator button and uh, learned how to fight booze. All right, so see you later. Goodbye. Bye bye.